a man can do two third of a work in ten days, and a boy can do one fifth of the same work in five days. Now this is a method by which they have given you the number of days it takes for a man to finish the work and the number of days it takes for a boy to finish the work. So if I look at the man, two third of the work it is getting done in ten days. That means the total work will get done in how many days? Two parts of out of the three parts of the total work is getting done in two days. So one part will be done in five days. So three parts will be done in fifteen days. So you will get down to this value. Now same way for a boy, one part out of the five parts is getting done in how many days? Five days, right? So five parts out of five parts will get done in how many days? Twenty-five days. So the total number of days that the boy takes to finish the work is twenty-five days, and the total number of days that the man takes to finish the work is fifteen days. Now. i can start by presuming that the total unit of work that the total unit of work is 75 which is nothing but the lcm of 25 and 15 you can take this as any number but taking the lcm helps you solve the question a little faster because it gives you integers almost on every step of the calculation so the total work if i presume it as 75 units in 15 days a man will complete 75 units of work that means every day the man would cover what five units so five units per day will be the number of units done by a man in every, man every day and the number of units done by a boy every day will be what 75 divided by 25 that's going to be what three units per day now what's the question saying starting with the boy so on the first day boy is working and boy will finish how many units three units then on the second day man will be working and the man would finish how many units on the second day five units so total amount of work done in two units will be what eight two days will be what eight units now we would realize in two days both of them are able to finish eight units right on the third day what will happen the cycle will start all over again and the boy will work and get three units completed right so how many such complete two days can be there so i will try to go as close as possible to this 75 units by multiplying this 8 into 9 and i'll get what i'll get 72 units of work done in how many days this 2 should also be multiplied by 9 because this 8 was multiplied by 9 so i can very easily say that in 18 days i'll be able to finish 72 units of work now if you go further you will realize on every odd day boy is working on every even day man is working so in 18 days you are able to finish 72 units so on the 19th day who will be working a boy will be working right and this boy will finish three more units so 72 plus 3 will make it what 75 units of work and that was the total unit of work so the work will get over in how many days the work will get over in 19 days